नमस्ते फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू द सारथी टेक्नोलॉजी दिस इज द सेकेंड वीडियो ऑफ एंड्रॉयड वॉली लाइब्रेरी ट्यूटोरियल एंड इन दिस वीडियो फर्स्ट वी विल लर्न हाउ टू एड द लाइब्रेरी इन द प्रोजेक्ट एंड आफ्टर दैट वी विल क्रिएट वन सिंपल स्ट्रिंग रिक्वेस्ट ओके सो द फर्स्ट थिंग हाउ टू एड द लाइब्रेरी इन द प्रोजेक्ट सो हेयर यू कैन सी वी हैव दिस वेबसाइट गूगल डॉट गिटअप डॉट आई ओ फॉरवर्ड स्लैस वॉली एंड हेयर इफ यू स्क्रॉल डाउन हेयर यू कैन सी द डिपेंडेंसी दैट वी नीड टू यूज सो जस्ट कॉपी दिस एंड इन द प्रोजेक्ट ओपन ग्रेटल फाइल एंड हेयर पेस्ट नाउ क्लिक ऑन दिस सिंक नाउ बटन now sync is completed the second thing because this will use internet so we need to add internet permission and for that we need to open manifest file so here uses permission and here internet okay so next thing we need to create one simple string request and for that first open this activity underscore main dot xml and here i have created one text view and one button okay so when we will press this button one request will be sent to the server and in return we will get one string that we will show in this text view okay so in our example we are using this this is w3schools.com forward slash xml forward slash note dot xml this is xml file and when we will request this file we will get this text okay so we are just going to use this in our example so the first thing in the main activity dot java here we have button and text view object and their find view by ids next thing we need to create one string object that will hold this url so here we will paste url so url is this so just copy and paste okay so we have this url and the next thing create one request queue object request queue new request queue and here this okay now create one string request object and it will ask four arguments first is method second is url third is response listener and fourth is error listener so first is request method so request method will be get in our example comma the url now here we need to pass response listener so new response listener press enter and the fourth is error listener so here put comma and
error listener okay now here semicolon so here we will send request using get method url will be this and if we will get response we can use this object and if there is any error we will use this object okay so here in this response use text view dot set text response okay now in the case of error we will use same text view dot set text and here error dot to string okay now create one on click listener of button and add this request in the queue so button dot set on click listener new on click listener and here q dot add string request okay so now let's try to run this application and see the result here you can see our application is running and now let's click on the send button and here in the response we have this text in this text view so friends this was the simple example how to create a simple string request now in the next video we will learn how to create one json request so this is end of this video please like this video and also you can share this video with your friends so thanks for watching see you in the next video till then bye